Alright guys, are you ready? Because Love, Victor season 2 is out and I am just... I am so excited to watch it. I am already stressed though, just by how season 1 ended. <laughs> we are in for a wild, wild, stressful, painful time. But it's gonna be fun. Are you guys ready to watch season 2? Because I am so excited. Let's go. Here's hoping for the ace rep at some point this season. Please. Not nothing. I'm gay. That's our boy. Oh my god. They just plopped us right in. I don't know if I was mentally prepared. Oh, Pilar, you're a real one, girl. Look at her. I love you. Fuck. I wasn't ready. I wasn't ready for this. Hell yes, Pilar. When did you decide this? Decide, sir. I didn't decide it. Every time someone says, well, you can just decide it, I just assume they're not straight and they've just repress that part of who they are, you know? Is that a hot take? I don't know. Mom, could you please say something? <laughs> I, I don't know if we want her to say something. Maybe silence is better, Think. judging by the trailer. Um, oh dear. Yeah, we should get some rest. That's not... We can talk about it tomorrow. How about an I love you? I love you, son. You're pretty awesome. Anything, please? Oh, shit. I wasn't I'm sorry. mentally prepared. But, uh, hey, Dude, you got a lot of natural light. light. Wow. <laughs> I hate that I am just the adults in all of these shows. God damn it. They just had a better high school life. I feel like I, I, I feel like I skipped the fun parts of high school and I just became the person talking about adult shit. Great. So the Benji Meister, I said, sup. He's channeling his discomfort with me having a boyfriend into nicknames. Benjamin Button. Benvenido. Hey, he's trying his goddamn best, okay? And we, we, we appreciate it so much. Hey, Benji. What up? Is he back at the other one now? Did he get his job back? Because he transferred. Oh my down. god, that's cute. Like, we're in our own little summer bubble and we have this- That's not sanitary. Totally perfect secret. But- I gotta say- Cute. What? We got yeah, no. Felix a job. Oh, I'm excited for him. Yeah, I know you guys are horny, but anyone gonna make my sugar-free ice milk up? On it? Yeah, right away. <laughs> The way you can just tell they both hate and love Lake, I can't. No more hiding who I am or who I'm into. Benji's so excited. Like, you know he probably wouldn't have pressured him, but look at how excited he is to be like, oh, you want to be seen with me. This is amazing. Look at him. Oh, last weekend before school start. What are we thinking? Scrabble night. Oh, was before homos. Understood. No, no. Okay. <laughs> just that sounded really wrong in her mouth. I'm sorry. You know, my mom. You, you guys know how she <laughs> is. If she's not ready, she's not ready. It's fine. Benji tried so hard to be understanding. Uh, he's going to be more understanding of the rest of us, I feel like. Um, Benji's coming too. Oh. You. Great. <laughs> I'm just, I don't know what that noise was, but it feels accurate to the situation. Can I go home? Oh. What? I'm just very confused as to why he got the other apartment. I just feel like maybe the mom should have moved out. I don't know, something about how the situation went down makes me feel like it wasn't really the dad's fault and he shouldn't be the one subjugated to moving all of his shit out. I, I don't know. Like, you are very lucky, ma'am. Hey. Mind your business, okay? They're probably kissing once outside so that you don't have to see it. Mind your business, ma'am. What the hell? Are you really gonna just like, you don't want them eating in your house at all? That seems a waste. There were other people coming. I don't know what happened, but I went to go check on the food and the stove must be broken or something because it's totally burnt. You're a terrible liar. This has been uh, really great so far. I just gotta quickly oh, shit. This call. If she leaves, outside, away from here. We can't lose Lake. <laughs> She's like the person that diffuses stressful situations. Come on, we need her. I called you like a I've million I've been times. off the grid. Oh. <laughs> I just, I needed time to, to clear my head, but I'm home now. Can I come over? Wait, I'm sorry. Lake called you a bunch of times and you ignored every single one of her calls, but you had your phone in your hands while you were at camp, and now all of a sudden you want her to put down everything she's been doing to hang out with you. Mia, I really like you, but that's kind of... kind of questionable. Questionable. You know, Benji actually likes a lot of the same music as you, Ma. Christian Rock? I don't think so. Well, you are... <laughs> Gonna have to give me your recipe someday, Benji. I mean, usually that's top secret, but. But if I marry into the family, maybe. I had too much sauce. Um, I got this like acidy reflux thing, so. 
Yeah, okay, yeah, sure it was the salsa. Victor, if I said I don't feel good, I don't feel good. They have me, okay? I, it kills me that the entire friend group is here to watch her have a breakdown. <laughs> I already miss you half the time. I don't need to miss a turtle too. <laughs> that didn't need to strike me in my very core. That was heartbreaking. That shouldn't be a heartbreaking moment. It's just a kid with this turtle. Frick. I knew the divorce plot was gonna get to me. I knew it. Frick. Oh God. We had Heather. We lost Heather. Now, how did you find her? Frickin' Edward Cullen over here. I got your care package. <laughs> I'm sorry that I didn't respond. Andrew sent her a whole goddamn care package? Oh my god. He sent her a care package. Andrew, up a thousand points. Uh, when did you guys... Uh, Steve Danahy's 4th of July party. Ah. Weird, right? I'm so not into jocks. Can Lucy be ace rep, please? Can I, I just looking for anyone. Just, just anyone. I, anyone. Anyone. Also, she looks cool. 53 minutes away? No. That's an introvert night. That's not happening. He's my son. And it's who Thank he you. Is. Yes. I, have I love this guy. Look at him. You both do. Him being like, you gotta do it too, okay? You have to do it too. I don't wanna be related to the homophobic person. Get your life together, ma'am. Okay, I think we got it. Oh, wait, this no, I wanna, so I wanna do the This is so Go for it. This is like how murder mysteries start. Hey, Felix, let's go get the fireworks from the car, huh? But it's cool. Oh, Felix is my life. Those two are kind of perfect together. I think they just are really actually both good at emotional intelligence, which is like crazy. They can both sort of diffuse situations, which is honestly quite good in a show like this. It's cute. You know, you don't have to pretend everything's okay when we talk about how shitty your mom's being. She won't let you tell Adrian that you're gay. Uh, you're allowed to be pissed off. Thank you. Wow, actually. <laughs> See, I feel like Victor is gonna absolutely hate that he just said that because he doesn't want anyone admitting that his mom is actually being very shitty. But um, <laughs> I actually love that he said that because the whole first season was Victor not allowing himself to feel emotions and putting himself on the back burner to like take care of everyone else's problems. So I love how Benji is immediately like, hey, you are actually allowed to have these emotions. Like you're allowed to prioritize yourself, your feelings. You don't have to keep putting them on the back burner. Also the fact that that kind of works with like everything that Benji went through with Derek. His name was Derek, right? Ugh. But I feel like Derek never took Benji and his interests seriously too. So it's like Benji learned that. Now he's trying to let help Victor learn it. I just, ah, I love their dynamic. Wish things could be as simple as you and me Lake and Felix in our perfect little summer bubble. Oh, Victor, it is that simple. I feel like we gotta get you guys to graduate high school and then y'all can get a cute little apartment in New York City. You can go chill with Simon and his roommates. I hope you guys make it through this, please. You have to join in. You just drove 53 minutes. Although she would be fifth wheeling. You drove 53 minutes. Oh God. That is so depressing. They really said, we're gonna throw all this pain in the first episode, which makes me very worried for the rest of the season. How could you just let that man be staring at an empty turtle tank? <laughs> so he really just tried to move on with the Fuck am I actually crying? I cannot already be crying. It's only episode one. It's only episode one. They, they can't be doing this to me. How are you feeling? I can't believe we're seeing Felix's mom. Did you eat? Oh God. No. I'm not hungry. Gotta eat, uh, mom. <laughs> this is so unfair for Felix. Is your job at the coffee shop is not gonna be able to afford rent. Oh my God. Benji is my boyfriend, and I'd like you to call him that. He is setting boundaries. Good on you. After the whole first season of him not standing up for himself, good for him. You know what? Before we watch episode two, we are getting a tissue because holy shit, they just threw that pain at us. It's the freaking first episode. It shouldn't be that painful. But, but it is. I need to get a tissue. I will be right back. If you aren't mentally prepared for them to be at school for the first time, clap your freaking hands because, oh my God, this is gonna be stressful. It's gonna be stressful. But episode two, let's go. Archie has a sister. 
as Meghan and Harry celebrate the birth of their daughter. Why is this an before, ad? A royal baby born in America. Is she still a royal baby? Original event. I don't know. Streaming only on Hulu. Oh, right. That was an odd ad. Victor, in honor of your first day back at Creekwood, I wanted to say I'm proud of you. Honestly, mad kudos to Simon. Simon's dealing with starting a new semester, course load. He's in college, but he still took the time to write a letter to Victor. That's amazing. You know what? Simon, look at him. Good morning. Ah, we're going to change the hat Are you going to school or back in time to play jazz? Uh, lose the hat. Burn the hat. <laughs> Adrian is my life. So this thing between you and Benji, your boyfriend. The relationship, right? The relationship. People are going to hear your name. It's the first thing they're going to think about. I just want to make sure that that's something that you want. I wish I could believe that she said that with good intentions. Somebody tell me All right. That little clip of them in the coffee shop is so cute. I haven't seen your mother around in weeks. Is everything okay? No, you should have asked that ages ago. What was all that with the landlord? Nothing. We're just bribing him. It's no big deal. I can't believe you passed your driver's test. No, I know. I can't believe it either. I'm like a danger to others. There is no way Lake is straight. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Not with those driving skills. I can't. <laughs> she pulled in on that. <laughs> Me pulling into a parking spot, honestly. I do feel like we need to get on top of the story and make it absolutely clear you did not turn him gay. What? <laughs> no, I really hope Lake becomes a PR agent. She thought of every single angle that could possibly arise from this moment and she said, Mia, Mia, you're my girl. We're gonna get you on top of this, okay? Nothing about you is gonna look bad as long as I'm on your side. <laughs> Remember that time I went to a Harry Styles concert and everyone was saying we hooked up in this dress? No room? one said that. <laughs> Nobody was saying that except you. Also, can we please talk about how Lake would be perfect in the Gossip Girl reboot? Are you stressed about telling yes. anyone? Yes. No, I'm good. Because his mother gave him a little fear. You still, uh, Vic deep in that? <laughs> you get it? It's like dick deep. No, no, yeah, yeah, I get it. It's just not funny. <laughs> <laughs> I love Victor. We broke up. What? Why? Ah! Uh, you got this. You got this. If you want to, you've got this. I, I was here for the summer and she was 200 miles away oh, at some fuck. summer camp. This is gonna hurt Benji too. Or, didn't cheat on me or anything. It was Don't the worry, other way around. Like, we'll find you a new honey soon. For sure. Ah, uh, <laughs> that was too straight. Too straight. And Benji's like, what the fuck was what that? Was that? <laughs> Can we just kind of ease our way into it? Whatever you want. I was not ready for this one. Victor Salazar and Mia Brooks broke up this summer. Don't let your girl go to camp. She was a fucking camp counselor. Who do you think she was hooking up with? There were children there. That is slander. She cheated, obvious. I heard she was FaceTiming with Victor right before she had full on sex with some lifeguard. Oh God. Now this is how you make the villain of a queen bee at the school. I feel so bad for Mia. Oh, hell no. <laughs> it's a nightmare for a PR agent, Lake. This one could barely keep her hands off me. Can you okay, blame her? I, I, I guess what? she's not the ace rep, but she could have been, she could have been. Body's been next level ever since I started drinking raw eggs for breakfast. Okay, Mr. Sporty Pants. Have you guys started telling people you're dating him? I love Lucy. I don't care. Hey, can I talk to you for a second? They just slide down five feet. They can still hear you. Victor's our boy, right? And something happened or you'd still be together. Yeah. Oh God, oh God, oh God, oh God, Victor, you please. Don't you don't need that s'more whore. <laughs> <laughs> what the hell? That was solid. Solid. Um. Mia's like, peace out. Well, the principal told us that Wyatt was spreading nasty rumors about Mia. Yeah, so we understand you felt you had to stand up for her. That is what happened, actually. I love how the principal like knew that. Wait, did it go to the vice principal? Because I love that woman. She would have been me in that situation. Like, oh, so he knocked someone down because that person was literally calling a girl a whore. Can I suspend the other dude? That would make me feel better. Victor, you're off the hook. I could hear your voice in my head begging me not to tell anyone that I was gay. <sighs> the dad, like, whoa, don't rope me in on that. This, this is all really new for us, but of course we support you. The dad no matter does. What. Not you. <laughs> Victor's 
Like, I know you support me. Her. Does the dad have a guest room you can live in? You and Felix? We can get both of you out there. He tried to cover for you. You you couldn't do it. I wish I could feel pity for her. I really do. I just... Ah. Uh, not at that stage of my life. I, she needs to get on board. It's 2021, honestly. Also, she literally cheated. I just... Uh. I'm not on the meal plan, so this is my dinner. A starving artist and everything. <laughs> Who wrote this? A grown-ass adult wrote this, I swear. What year are you? Um, High school. Freshman? College freshman? No! How old are you? Is she 16? She's definitely not 18. It's BY online. Is it bring your own cheese too? You can take the whole platter. What are you escaping? Mom stuff. Mom stuff. It's the mom stuff stoop. 200, right? Girl, how do you just have that? Holy shit, Lord, how did you get it? <laughs> it's from my summer job, selling mop pretzels. <laughs> Me and my friends were saving up to see Billie Eilish, but it's sold out now anyway, so. Oh. You pay me back. I love her. I love Felix. This frick. And Victor would be the only one who missed me. <laughs> I'm not going to I can't. Oh my god. I have had at least two gay boyfriends, and the jury's still out on Steve. <laughs> <laughs> Steve is not denying it. Ah, I, I really needed this, so thank you guys. You had it out? Yes. Which dorm? I'll, I'll no, walk her father. It's a strip club. What? what? I know. Just please don't give up on me. He won't. Benji is such a big heart. You won't, right? Okay. It's that Padme meme. I don't think I could give up on you. <laughs> even if I wanted to. <laughs> that is secret code. Maybe our little secret. That's even cuter. That's cuter than holding hands. I can't take this. Not Google, dad with gay teen, by the way. I'm not sure I can call myself a Catholic anymore. <laughs> but no, I, you I, just I... don't click the link, sir. Right now, we're losing. This dad? I, standing ovation to this dad. <laughs> I guess I'm just over the high school. She's though. already in college mode. You don't owe me anything. You're not my boyfriend anymore. He's, but he still wants to be a good person. Sorry, secret romances kill me. Uh, what are you doing? Uh, what I should have done yesterday. Uh, <laughs> Excuse me. Oh my god. Hey. This is amazing. Not that it's anyone's business. So let's right. start. I'm gay. I'll clap for you. <laughs> I'm with Benji now. I'm happy about it. Like, I'm so proud. Like, really, really. I'm so proud of him. We won't be taking any questions at this time. <laughs> Solid. Yes. Dear Simon, it wasn't as smooth as I planned. Are. Maybe one day I can inspire someone to be themselves the same way you inspired me. And Pilar's friend staring at them. You know he just inspired him. Oh, God. Love, Victor. Yes. Okay, this season is already off to an absolutely amazing start. Like. Holy shit. I'm so proud of Victor. <laughs> it feels so good to be like existing in their world again because oh my god, I love all of them. They're all so precious to me. The mom needs to get her shit together, but they're also precious to me. Anyways, I hope you guys liked episode one and two. Give this video a big thumbs up if you did and subscribe if you want more movie and fandom related content. I will see you guys for the next one. Thanks for watching. See ya.